off into this game with uh, Ronnie playing Unicorn versus Anish playing uh, his Phoenix, uh, both playing with their latest strongholds. And uh, Ronnie playing with the latest Keeper of Fire rule. Oh, there's Keeper. I probably would have bought the keep, uh, keep, uh, Project of the Ways probably with three fate. Because like, you just attack air, a water and then... Right. Uh, you know, there are some things like Oof, you that. put two on, you leave yourself a fate. I mean, you're probably going to pass. Mm -hmm. So you want the one maybe for a clarity of purpose in the first round to get three conflicts oh, And then you can also the do a, a guess Oasis as well in case uh, yeah. you want to defend three times for some reason. First bid's probably like maybe five, five. I suspect so. Unicorn's not going to be putting uh, pressure, dis dishonor pressure. I don't think Anish tried to go dishonor Phoenix for a long time, but I don't think he's trying that anymore. He got me good with that one time. Yep. I can't tell. It looks like. Yep. So embrace the void over on. Uh, I can't even read that card. Moto Nergui. Oh yeah, right. I'm very impressed with this card. You like it? I like it a lot, actually. It's enough worthy to get it. Cloud the mind in. <clears throat> um, I believe. I think I saw a reprieve in Ronnie's hand, so maybe he's crab splash. Yeah, it's a crab splash uh, unicorn or unicorn slash crab. <laughs> Um, looks like military, military water. water. Ooh, upholding authority. Mm. I guess that's not that bad. No, it's always good to be able to pull yeah. some cards from your hand. So no defender on Ronnie's side. And I, I think he passed. Yep. Not sure what Anish is thinking about here. <laughs> Perhaps he's trying to lower his stats and so he doesn't break? No. Oh, huh. that's weird. Isn't he already breaking? Oh, no, I know what it is. He oh, doesn't want to lose, lose cards, it. yeah. He, might, he must have two katanas in hand. Or maybe he just doesn't want to lose a, a specific card that... Uh... Oh, no, interesting. Oh, I my. Yeah. Okay. Being able to pull the Nino is pretty good. Yeah. Now, to be honest, that might have been more tempting than the fine katana. Just yes. cycle it back in the deck. Yeah. Actually, though, if you don't have access to it, you got two more. They're going to cycle through. If he's going to pull the Nino as opposed to another card, it's actually probably for the best. That's true. It means it's one last card to get discarded from Shrine Maiden or stuff like that, too. So. Yeah. So Anish uses the uh, ready ability on the Prodigy. Yep. Oh, we're going to check out a province. Perhaps the Kudak? No. Okay. What could it be? Before the throne. <laughs> Bless you. Okay. So, so much for not playing towards Dishonor at all. <laughs> I, guess there was, I guess he's still got a little Dishonor left in his head. <clears throat> Vic was just reminding them that he didn't lose his uh, undefended honor. So Nurgui probably gonna come in military void ire. Oh well, if the fire seems pretty good. Well, so it's political, like political fire. fire. Just with the wayfinder. <coughs> I. Hmm. He does have a captive audience in his hand. Mm hmm. Okay. Defends with Keeper Initiate. Yep. Just kill it off right away. Oh, that's easy enough. Yep. Interesting. So I see the, the Nezumi character in uh, Ronnie's hand as well. Mm. 
Ja. Seems okay. You just get claims the second ring. What do you think? Um, Earth. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're going confirming that no one's uh, he doesn't have any conflict actions. Oh, endless planes. Oh my dear God. Oh dear. Goodbye, Prodigy. <laughs> <laughs> so Wow, okay. Uh I, I will break. <laughs> yeah. So just this is a reaction as it's revealed. Uh it gets to uh um, okay. Oh. And there goes the prodigy. Not as bad as losing a, a three fate prodigy from a noble sacrifice, but you know. It's, not no, it's not it. great. <laughs> it's still not good. It's no good. I guess we're just gonna pass. Ring goes back into the middle. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe go air. Air seems pretty cool. So this one is going in with uh, military earth. Yeah. Back it before the throne. So I'm thinking. Just two strengths so far. He probably Ronnie's probably gonna just keep using that promise to farm. Maybe. Yeah. So losing our front opposed. Loses a card, loses a supernatural storm. Okay. I mean, at least the card is that he can still play, yep. but. <clears throat> card, still losing a card, still not bad, too. Yeah. Uh, so, Ronnie, uh, or Anish wins the Imperial favor. Two ranks to one. Gonna leave it on military, it makes a lot of sense against yep. Unicorn. Uh, and then, Ronnie should be giving that fade over. Yep, thank you. Okay. <clears throat> Two promises to zero. Okay. That's a. I did not expect uh, endless planes. Did you? No. <laughs> but given the towers that everyone's playing these days, I think it makes sense. Yeah. But I mean, Ronnie's in a bit of a. I mean. And each has nothing on his board, so he's not in that bad of shape. But having two provinces broken is not, not the best situation to be in. Oh, and then I really like that new uh, uh, Shigenja character as well. The one that's on the third province. Yeah. It, like, switches positions, so it's, like, a really interesting strategist. Oof. Oh, and Psalm Scholar with two. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, well, we do know that he has a censure in his hand, so he may th he's thinking that Assassinate he, can, he can dodge be. the assassinates. Yeah. yeah, sounds about right. Oh, no, I see why he wanted to buy more, because of the, the holding that Anish has. Because he just claims as if he has an earth ring at the beginning. Right. He could just bow an attacking character. Okay. Yeah. Well, and also, now that Endless Place is dead, you don't have to lose another character to uh, that anymore. Oh. So, looks like both players pass after playing both their characters. Someone have weird characters in it? Probably like a three something. Five to two. Okay, so one, two, three. Uh, ooh, cow reserves. That's like an okay card. Not so great at this moment, but that's all right. Here, I'm gonna let Victor jump in for I like, look at something in the overlay. What was the bid? Uh, five to two. So, uh, so seven honor for Ronnie and then uh, ten for Anish. Okay. So I'm probably thinking. Ronnie goes maybe air or void to knock at least one of these off. <clears throat> but the ability that uh, I could not hear if Anish announced what uh, ring he claimed 
with the holding. I'm gonna guess it's Earth. 100. percent Yeah. I would I would think it's the same as well. Uh, probably defend with the keeper, and then if anything dangerous happens, you just bow it. Oh, two people coming in. Okay. Do we do we know what um, do we know what splash Ronnie's on? Yet? I, he's on crab. He's on crab I splash. Saw, I saw a reprieve. I saw the Nezumi Shadowlands guy. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah. The one that uh Isn't I, it uh you remove a fate from something or it's something about um they sorry, my apologies. It uh reduces or increases the problem strength or something. Right. By one? Anyway, in the meantime, Ronnie just played a captive audience, losing yep. one honor, uh, switching it to political. Military. Or Solid. sorry, military. You're right. Hmm. So, so that's interesting all... that Ronnie plays a cavalry reserves, knowing that Anish has a uh, censure in hand. So I guess still goes with it. Yeah. Okay. That's, I mean, that's one of the cards I would auto censure right there. Maybe he just didn't. Maybe? Consider it? No, maybe he wants to hold on to it in case there's another yeah. dangerous event. Well, one of the other things to consider is that Ronnie's at six honor and he's going after before the throne. That's true. So uh, Anisha's plan now so, might be to go for straight up dishonor. Well, okay, so. <laughs> now, having said that. And let's go back. Yeah. G generally, you're supposed to play that card before your opponent gets stuff from their pile, but. Oh, there's another one, so <laughs> you did it. So yeah. I believe it's a one, two, three, four, five, six actually to two because uh, this is the first military conflict. That's right. And it's a three. I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Still not enough to break, but uh, this is also going to. Oh yeah, hold on a sec. That yep. thing's not a. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. So, Crane, I mean, Ronnie normally plays Crane, which is probably why he's not familiar with all the cards. So, funny thing, I thought uh, <laughs> also uh, the Taco Infantry was a... <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, he, he even confirms, he just says he doesn't know any of that. So, so that's still five, five right? Three. Okay, still no break, that's fine. I mean that. That being said, I don't know if that was worth it for him. What's coming up? Yeah. Nope. Hmm. hmm. Supernatural storm. Go to five. Yeah. yeah. Then he, he can just play from his uh, discard pile again. Mm hmm Right. So Ronnie's winning. I guess he. he I saw a bonsai in his hand. Oh, there's that. Sh there's that Nizumi. Um, what did you say it does? We can't bring it up yet, right? Okay. Something about reducing... Uh... Sorry, th th this is one of the new cards from the cycle. We don't have it in our uh, image database yet, so we can't pull it it's up. It's about reducing... Uh... It's so weird. It You can increase or decrease an attacking promise by oh, one. Oh, right. But yeah. I don't want... I cannot think of a reason why you would want to raise it. Well, on your, if you're on defense, right? If you're on defense, you want to raise your province? Because it says the attacked province, right? It could be your own. Gotcha. Gotcha. That makes more sense. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's crab, right? So yeah. it would make no, sense no, no, to no, work I didn't, on the uh, defense. I didn't anticipate the... Yeah. So what? So anyway, meanwhile, back to the game. He wins the conflict, doesn't break. Uh, he's going to trigger the uh, Hiru Mori Toride. Yeah. What is it? How do you pronounce it? Hero. Anyway, the unicorn stronghold. Uh, he sacked one of his cavalry characters to get an extra military conflict. Then he voided Kadaka. Although I don't know if that was a great use of cavalry reserves. Mm. Yeah, I think if if Ronnie did have it. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Because what is he gonna follow it up now with? He's. I guess he's gonna. His battle maiden recruit has been turned on now. That's right. Yeah. Right, the void ring. But now he can't, he's not going to be able to defend this attack. What he could do is send his Shinjo Outrider in and then use the Shameful display. But that's not right, a very efficient least, use yeah. of Shameful either. This is what, a military conflict? Just reset political. It political? Looks like. Okay. I think it's political. Yep. Yeah. So even a Shameful display uh, trigger is not going to. Stop yeah. the break here. 
I feel like Ronnie would probably want to keep this cavalry actually. Uh, yeah, I don't. Around so that ca cavalry reserves is the kind of card you wait until later in the game to use. Yes. Um, I think he he was way too aggressive with firing those off. Yeah, and he, he didn't even get max value wouldn't. off of it either. Yeah. He only got three cost worth of stuff. So, all right, so it's uh, three to. It's zero? three to zero. Yeah, that doesn't grant you any political and. <clears throat> Yeah, right? Like, look, he's in this situation where he... Probably should put that Invocation of Ash on, at least, if you don't want to lose it. Looks like Ronnie has, what, two Fate left? Something like that? Yeah, it looks like he has two Fate left. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Classic RTFC moment. This is not a position you want to be in as Unicorn. Just I, play, yeah. playing stuff so that it doesn't break, but you're still letting... Anish, uh, trigger the air ring, get his card, get his fate. If I were him, I would just focus on, like, not letting him break it. Yep. Because now what, like, do you have, does he have another character to initiate another conflict with? Yeah, it just uh, doesn't seem like this turn was very productive for Ronnie. He spent six fate on two event cards. Yep. Neither of which helped him break the province. Nope. And then he sent his battle maiden in just so that the shameful display wouldn't break. I get it. Shameful display is like a very good province against Phoenix. Oh. But when you're when you're this sort of far behind. Yeah. Yeah. When and you're this far uh, behind, I think you have to ra start racing. Like at this point, do you go after the? Uh... Although, yeah. That being said, he did go for the. He did have a that guy in hand. Okay. So military attack. Ooh, Ooh. that's a nice uh, one to run into without a. Uh, so, Anish does have a display, of, display power. of power. He could also use a shrine maiden if he wants to at least get some value off of it. So. Actually, actually, a shrine maiden. Oh no. Okay, he's going for the break with the invocation. Yep. Very interesting that. Um, Did he lose an honor there? Now he's at three or four. He's at four. Okay. But here comes the display of power. Oh, oh there that, we go. That, that's the exact same reaction I have every time I get display of power yep. put on me. Very, <laughs> very brutal. Lame. And what was that? The fire ring, too? Oh, my God. Yeah. So he's going to so dishonor. At least, at least Anish loses an honor for unopposed, but it doesn't look like he lost it yet. So... Uh, I don't think I don't think Anish's honor total is going to matter that much in this yeah, game. Yeah, just dishonor the outrider. Yeah. I think Ronnie really wanted to get the firing so that he could uh, do another attack with the Keeper Initiative, but that's what happens. So, neutral, uh, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. This ain't looking good. <clears throat> Uh, the Dirty Deeds just ask how Ronnie, sorry, Anish win that ring? That, uh, Did that he just political? ask that question? Yeah, yeah, he played Display of Power. That's how he got the ring. He didn't win the conflict, but he got the ring. And he still keeps Imperial Favor, so he keeps it in the military. Yep. Oh, I kind of see why Ronnie wants to go. Because uh... I'm pretty sure the the cal the water recruit. How did how did Ronnie have four? It was uh, battle maiden recruits only get plus two military. Yeah, they only get plus two military. They get zero uh, political. So like he got two from the invocation, but that was it. Like it was yeah. three against two, but still. Yeah. So. Border Rider's nice. I mean, I really like that uh, that province that's on the far or the holding that's on the far left or right actually, the one that can ready as long as you have a military ring claimed. Shinotome encampment. Yeah. Shinotome encampment. Which kind of makes sense why Ronnie wants to go crab as his uh, splash maybe to get rebuilds and just keep using the ability. My my initial version of the. The unicorn deck ran crab for that same reason too. I mean, when you get your when you get your momentum going, like when you get force of the river down, 
And uh, yeah, when you get Force of the River down and then you start getting multiple yes. conflicts in turn with your yeah. big guy, and then you charge in like Minakami Kaze regulars and all That's that. That's right, yeah. Oh my god. Well, when the train good. gets rolling, Unicorn these days is pretty scary, but the problem is uh, Anish has been crushing the tempo fight here. Uh, yeah, it's like that timing on display of power. That's like the perfect time to use it. Yep. Did, so, what did he end up doing with uh, the firing? He ended up dishonoring the Shinjo Outrider so that the honor gained and honor loss was uh, neutral zero. Okay. So Feast here's a famine. ooh a Chinese feaster famine. That's pretty swaggy. Oh, did he flip a Kudaka off of the uh, start? <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. Why? Uh, so can you reset the attack to... Oh, yeah. So, uh, before we go any further, I believe Anish indicated that during a water conflict, the, uh, the Phoenix character got plus two, plus two. Mm -hmm. And, uh, coverted, I would imagine, Nirgui. Yep, there's that, uh, reprieve so that doesn't get assassinated. Uh, trying to leak in the side of the monitor to see what kind of cards, uh, Anish has again. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six against two. One. Yeah, six against two. Surprised he would uh, actually cover the border rider instead of the Nergui. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. So now up to three against uh, two. Moves over to shameful display. Nice. Pass it again. Let's do the, yep. Yeah. Uh, dishonor. So goes up to one, two, three, four against one, two, four. three, four. Yeah. So still winning. <clears throat> Uses stronghold to get supernatural storm up to eight. Then I would imagine. Oh, always seems like Phoenix is an endless supply of like buffs. Yeah. Nowadays. They just have so many ways to uh, yeah. kind of cheat their way to uh, boosting up their guys. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, that that like uh, turn one cloud the mind of Nergui has done so much work for Anish. Yeah. Just not not having the ability just to like send people away is. Yeah. So. It, so there's the bonsai. Uh, this is one of the downsides of playing dragon, right? Unless you. You're running three Mia Mystics. You don't have any attachment hate. That's right. And I found that, um, like, that whole plan of going for reprise on your Shinotomi encampment, you're, like, hedging for a certain scenario where you mill it or it gets destroyed. Like, Yeah. I, I get it. You can also use it for windswept yurts, but I feel like um, attachment control is a lot more important. Yep. Like, it's a lot more useful in a lot more situations than yep. uh, simply waiting until you get your holdings broken and then playing rebuilds. So, still 8-8. Eight eight. Looks like they put the Shrine Mater in out of the conflict. Oops. I would imagine he would have put it in the conflict, but that's okay, too. So, I would actually put that Nezumi, yeah. So, go up to 9 to increase the boost by 1. So, it's 8 against 9 now. Looks like it's a pass. Okay, so wow, Ronnie defends uh, successfully with that one. Very nice. Okay. Uh, uses the. Oh, I know it's not the. Ma it's a kind of like a magistration where you just gets to ready anybody as long as you have a military ring claimed. So it still has the Border Rider uh, ability off as well. So that basically can do two attacks or combination of attacks and defense. So should be down to. Th and the Stronghold has not been used yet, even though it looks like it has been used. Hmm. Interesting. Well, yeah. Anisha's has, Ronnie's hasn't. Sorry? 
Ronnie's hasn't, but Anisha's has. Yes, this turn. yes, that's correct. Military, yeah. okay. So military going in at one, two, three, four, four. against upholding authority. I guess that's okay. Has another display of power too, so <laughs> that's uh, it's not bad. Uh, if that was a niche, I probably could do that and turn on a scholar. Yes, that would be very good. I like that. Yep, <laughs> yep. Display here we go. Display yeah, display of power. Here we go. So it loses an honor for unopposed. So looks like. So the break province happens first. So he's going to look in the yeah. hand. Uh, is that the one where you send uh, someone home or? Um, I can't can't remember With that what? that you. No, no, the unicorn uh, event that's on the second from the left. It's something about you can send someone home or back. Oh, dispatch. Thank you. Thank you. Very interesting card. Yeah, it's either move something in or something out. That's correct. Out. Yeah, yeah. I think that's what Anish is thinking about as well. It's like a favorable ground. It's what the unicorn stronghold should have been. Yes. <laughs> that would have been nice. So, now triggers are Earth. Ooh, Cloud. cloud. Eh, there's no Shigenji character, so that's fine. Uh, so. Okay. I guess that's not a bad card to lose, because it looks like Ronnie... Is probably not going to be playing yeah. any <laughs> Shigenja against, uh, yeah. So now using Border Rider to ready the, um, uh, ready the Border Rider. <laughs> Surprised he didn't use the Stronghold to do another military conflict. He didn't have anyone that he was willing to sacrifice. Oh, he needs a Calvary, correct? Yeah, that's yeah. why. That's why. Nice is just weighing his options here, deciding uh, what kind of conflict he wants to declare. I kind of like error. Like, that that border rider is not leaving for another th right. three turns, so that honor is not going to contribute to anything. Um, yeah, let's go to... Political sure. error. Political error, going in at four. Yeah. This is Anisha's second conflict, so... Ronnie might want to just defend everybody with this because um, he can't uh, he can't do a successful attack because the skull, skull is just going to bow it down. Well, it keeps both characters up. He yes. Can. Yeah. Um, but I mean, now there are particularly strong political attacks. That's right. So very interesting uh, provinces uh, choice that Ronnie has. So, fire with Feast of Famine, earth with upholding authority. I wonder what his stronghold is. Water because it's uh, endless plains. Uh, shameful displays void. What could this be? Air? Oh, I guess it could be air. That makes sense. Okay, so let's against the waves up the Kodaka. So, yep. Wants to keep these uh, two characters around to defend, or. Hmm. Trying to think of what else might be a. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. So, yes. So, sitting in the middle of the table, I don't know why. I don't think actually Anish triggered his air as well to King Chaw Card and Fate either. Oh, he didn't do his Kadaka ability? No, he didn't use the Kadaka ability. Because he was at. Um, yeah. 
time. Oh well, that's fine. Excuse me. So. <clears throat> Just trying to decide if he's going to keep his encampment. I think I would. I think he is. You need to against this uh, setup. I mean, it is unfortunate that it's against four characters to two when... Uh, and Yish can just covert one of them. Yeah. I guess that's what the benefit of dispatch is there. Nah. Uh, Alright, that's okay. Ultimately decides to get rid of it. Yeah. So, flip. <laughs> well, it's a good thing he flipped, because uh, that's yeah. not a lot of characters you got there. No, we would have only had one. Yes, and the one that's only one is when you pass, you get it for free anyway. I'm not familiar with this character. What does she do? Brains around with three fate. I don't know what it is. Uh, Ichi Shahai? Oh my. It's like something. Shigenja. Just reduce the cost to play each Mishido's uh, attachment. Oh, only to the characters. Or to a neutral character. What? You paid and for And covert it? She's also covert. And that's the bigger thing. <laughs> oh, I see. It's uh, it's not a free play. You have to still pay for it. Gotcha. Gotcha. So it's like oh, you pass, but you... Okay, that makes sense. Whew, look at that. Phoenix Swarm, eh? I'd probably play another copy of... Uh... Okay. One. Oh, spyglass is set. All right, that seems pretty nice. Uh, so, and he's just declaring which uh, ring for the boost. I don't know what he just couldn't declare yet. With the water and earth. Okay, no, I don't know. I don't have a. <laughs> I, it's hard to yeah. see. I know one of them is water. Okay. That makes sense that Anish selected water because uh, he's probably going to attack with that. Because Ronnie's he's probably going to. Yeah, he's got some keepers as well. If we're up to me, probably might be good to actually attack with water as well. Just because uh, Ronnie, Anish does have a lot of characters with no fate on them. Right. But. Decides to let go of the spyglass. Yep. I would probably not risk playing the second uh, spyglass. Oh, why, why does it anyway? Because doesn't dispatch cost a fate to uh, bring someone in? Yeah, but you're probably going to declare you're gonna, you're going to get one off of the fight here, off the ring. Oh, so you're going to attack with fire? Okay. It's fire and water. Fire and water. Yeah, makes sense. So, does it specify on which one is what ring, or do they both get... No, one has, they have the itch to pick. Okay. It's only if you select both characters with the same ring, then they get plus two, plus two each. Okay. Yes. Okay. Declaring military combat here. I doesn't want to say too much, but... I guess you kind of have to, so you don't want to lose... Uh... So, five... One, two, three, four, five, yeah. Hasn't picked a ring, hasn't decided where he's going. Oh, oh. Nirgui coming into the party too. Oh, void. Really? Over fire. Interesting. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'm not sure why uh, the void over the fire there. I guess Ronnie sees something that we don't, and so he probably would defend with uh, me and Mystic for sure, obviously. Maybe he doesn't want to deal with the uh, plus two, plus two from the... Oh, man, I can't remember the name of these guys. Elemental Dreamer? Yes, the Dreamers, but... 
I don't know. Well, seven against. I don't know who's blocking. I think it's just the the scholar of the mystic, but. Uh, okay. Remembering his spyglass trigger. <clears throat> if he was really just wanting to, hoping to just defend one guy and then just send the whole armada over to the province, the stronghold, that might have been better, but. So it looks like both. Wait. Oh, it's these guys mm -hmm. on the right. Okay. Oh, it's the ones on the left. That's okay. So one, two, three, four, five. Against uh, seven. Yep. Use the meditations to remove a fate from the border rider. Sounds good to me. We're already down to two honor. We're, we're living on thin ice here. I'm going to have to ask him why he decided to go void instead of uh, a fire there. Okay. He is not a uh, cavalry. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, funny. <laughs> Can't sacrifice Bushi with that stronghold. So it just triggers void. Right? Yeah, knocks one off. Only one target, so. Come yeah. On. Unless he wants to take something off one of his own. Strategic play. Yeah. Very tricksy. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised that the Mia Mystic didn't defend there. It's not really a big... Uh, eh. Oh, well. I guess we shall see. So, gives the Elemental Dreamer, I would assume, covert during water conflicts. I believe that was what the indicator was about. Probably. Um... Ooh, this looks good. I think if Ronnie survives this round, he might be okay, but I don't know. We shall see. Oh, here we go. Covert in the border rider. Ooh, I think he... Oh, right, because he doesn't even uh, have two provinces broken yet. Or three broken yet. Okay, makes sense. <laughs> yeah, okay. So both those two with the value of can't tell is that military? It is military. Okay, so it's one, two, three, four, five. Yes. Against what's the her stats? Uchi something. Two four. Two four. Okay. And what's her glory? Does she have any glory? One. Oh one. Four. She has four glory? No, she has one glory. Sorry. She only has one glory. Sorry, I meant yeah. I'm surprised Anish didn't go, uh... You know? No, I was... Uh, he was asking how much glory she had. Yeah. Okay. Because, um... Hmm. Yeah, let's go over to Feast or Famine. I'm surprised he didn't actually break that, or kill off the Mystic to do this. Sad though, because the border rider is gonna get bowed. Oh wait! No, it's not. Uh, 
Oh, will it? No. No defenders. Because no the break happens. Oh, yeah. The reaction, gives a feed the reaction then, uh, to the break happens before the gotcha, ring. Gotcha. Gotcha. Ooh, reprieve gone. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh, so that's just... No, I don't understand why bother. Hmm. I mean, unless he has an assassinate in his hand, Bowl I move cotton. He has an assassinate. Does he? I, there's no real reason to remove the reprieve otherwise. No, I don't think I saw an assassinate from Anisha's no. hand. No, I didn't. Yeah, they, they, I think they're Scott, talking through what the uh, timing is. Because isn't it break, yep. then ring effect? Yeah. So, yeah. Oof. It's going to be... Muy caliente. Then, see, then why would you go uh, void if you wanted to put an additional two feet on the border rider instead of one? Interesting. Okay. I don't think he was thinking to this point. Well, now he's worried about the honor loss. That's why he wants to defend. Yeah, one against, uh, oh, rally. Yeah, makes sense. So, first Still one, breaks. Yeah, so this is kind of perfect. Uh-oh. What's going on here? Oh dear. Huh? Oh, just wants to ready uh, Kudaka, maybe? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yep. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah, it just has to do it uh, during the conflict. Yes. All right. I will take a fade off of over there. Uh, yep. Uh, Ready the adept of the waves with a ray effect. That keeper. <coughs> that defends value. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven military. Eight. One, two, three. Well, got to go air, right? But you don't want to attack with too many, because then Anisha will just attack back. Oh, man. Well, I don't know that he... Oh, he is going to go fire. So, gets the buff. Converts the Dreamer. Oh, she has Covert, yeah. too. Oh, interesting. So four against uh, whatever comes in. I defend this, right? Uh, well, you, some interesting ideas here. If you think you can come back for the break. Well, because then Ronnie also gets a character to defend as well. And it's also an uh, interesting... Uh, He's already used it. You've already used it this turn. Yeah. Okay, they realize. Ah, so five against four. Interesting. Okay. Clarity of purpose. Seems yep. pretty good. No, nope, just nope. pass, pass. Just pass, pass. Okay. But Ronnie takes a fair number of characters out, so not really worried about the break here. Yep. Can't, can't, can't blame him for that. But it does get to... Uh, I'm surprised. Did we decide what promise he had under his stronghold? Who, Anish? No, Ronnie. We have not seen it yet. I think it's an air province. But I don't know what kind of air province would it be. Uh, Manicure Garden? Fertile Fields? Manicure Garden. Fertile fields. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, so Spyglass. air, spyglass action. So one, two, three, four against two. One, two, three, four. Yep. Ooh, has an invocation of Ash as well in case as a uh, backup. That's nice. So. Anish, uh, oh, it's going to draw. I'll put that over there. 
Court game to keeper to go up to four. Nice. Ow, my chin. Yeah, invocation of Ash. Let's go up to six. I'm very impressed with that attachment. It's good. I like it a lot. Yeah, wins it. Defends successfully. So this is what I was talking about earlier. If Ronnie actually ends up surviving this round. I think he's uh he's in pretty decent shape. He's in uh okay shape. Yeah, okay. pretty decent maybe over stretching it a bit. Yeah. Well, I mean, he's only got one character around, <laughs> so that's a big indicator. So surprised that Mia Mystic didn't kill the um, Talisman. Talisman, yeah. Instead of the reprieve. Nito. I have a feeling he was not um, running the turn all the way through and realizing that the Feast or Famine was going to uh, yeah. keep the Border Rider alive. I yeah. think he thought it was going to be, I'll get rid of that, and he's gone this turn. Yo. See, that play would have made a lot more sense if he had an assassinate. But that's okay. That's a lot of fate to buy stuff. There's a lot of fate to buy stuff. So... But I guess also, that's the only saving grace. The only thing is, we haven't seen a lot of um, libraries yet. No, we have not. Oh, oh, speak of the devil. Oh, Ooh, that's still okay. Okay, it's okay. I think it's Kudaka boy. Well, Kudaka turns everything off. Yeah. Because I'm pretty sure most of the meaningful spells are in the graveyard. He has not played a dispatch yet. No. That's the only card that I can but think Cavalry of. Cavalry Reserve, Captive Audience. Yes. Yes. Bonsai is in there. Yup. <laughs> Each player wants to check out their own uh, discards. <laughs> Intriguing. Shinjo, what's his face? Shinjo, what's his face? That's the card. Sick. Sick. I like that guy. Shinjo, what's his face? Ronnie's like, is there a turn after this? Oh, you're going to do a water ring, so maybe I'll put a fade on him. Oh, there's that Mew Mystic again. Yeah. Really? Doesn't want to buy that guy. Huh. Okay. What do you think you didn't want to buy that? I'm not sure. Okay. The dupe, want... the dupe is... Oh, because there's a charge in his hand. That's Wouldn't right. Work. That's right. That makes sense. And he has not played a charge yet either. No. That's right. I mean, I think he would have liked to have seen something Ooh. more meaningful. Ooh. Look at that. Ooh. Oh, my. Oh, my. Look at all those juicy cards. Oh, man. Mm. mm, -mm, -mm. Oh my, two Feral Nino. Oh baby. Okay. He's setting aside the cards he can't play. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. That makes sense. Oh, he might as well put that card away too. He can't play. <laughs> oh, let go of the talisman. Mm -hmm. Rip. Okay. But uh, and he just doesn't have enough. Well, I mean, he's good. Uh, he doesn't have enough power to bring <clears throat> in here. No. Unless if he goes political, he goes military. All right. Woo! Everybody, everybody in. Every That's military water. Ten? Uh, five, nine, ten, eleven. That nope. is eleven. No, it's ten. What? Five, yeah. six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Damn. Damn. Math is hard. We got a whole bunch of people coming in here. Two, I, four, I would, I would six, send in this character too. Eight, nine, this nine. Yeah, I would have sent this character in too. 
the Shigenja. Because then as soon as Ronnie charges, he still will have enough more characters than... Uh, uh, yeah. Than Inishua, but eh, whatever. It is what it is. And there's still the censures out there. I don't know if any I don't think... Oh, rude boy. Rude boy. <coughs> Feels bad, bro. <laughs> oh, so Where's that Shugenja? So Where's that Shugenja? <laughs> that's, that's a neutral... No, that's a neutral character. So that means... And that, Cloud of the Mind... No, Cloud of the Mind's not Mishido. Never mind. <gasps> oh, all right. Gets one. Gets one. Not a meaningful card, though. Because mm -hmm. you're going to have to charge there, boy. Oh, buddy. Oh, he has not played one. Well, charge, does he care? Well, that's what I was saying. Like, if you had the. If you had more people, then this would be like a super strong boost uh, stats. But. He, oh, he can play Assassinate now. Yes. <clears throat> so he can't even think out here. Shinjo Shono. That's it. Instead of what's his face. A Shonjo. So yeah, when you control more characters than your opponent, each participating cavalry character gets plus one, plus one. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like if he did send the, what do you call it? I mean, he's got assassinate in his hand. Where? Mine. Ronnie does. Yeah. Oh, he does. Okay. You got all that fate back, so. Hmm. The only reason why I'm worried is because uh, those Feral Ninos are just going to show up. Just wreck his day. He's got two any? in his hand. Oh, does he, he drew it off of the five. Oh. It's very nasty. Never mind. It's a big nasty. I don't like it. Oh, well, let's draw a card. <laughs> oh, I think he drew Cowboy Reserves. Sad Tanda. Clouded the wrong guy. <laughs> Oh, there we go. There's a Nino. Yeah, how does... Does he not have... Does he have another cloud? No. What? No, I'm just trying to figure out why he didn't cloud the Daka. No, because then me and Missy just knocks it off. Right? Oh, yeah, right. Duh. Yeah. Sorry. No, no, no. We're in the same boat, man. I guess he could have assassinated and then done it. There we go. So it does assassinate the keeper. Ooh, loses three stats. Here comes another Nino. <laughs> I don't know what the, he's hesitating here for. I think he should play the other Nino. I guess he's also thinking like, okay, what happens if I win this conflict? He could actually actually break this, considering that uh, he has a supernatural storm, doesn't he? It's worth one. Two. Oh, two. No, it's not a lot, but you know, it's something. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Could you pull up Shona again? Does Shona only work if you have more? Uh, Cowboy characters than they do, or is it only cavalry buffs? I think it's. I think you need more people, and then cavs get bonus. Yes. Okay. Damn. Damn. Feels no good, man. Feels no good. So one, six, seven, ten, eleven. Yeah. I don't know. Are they still thinking about other actions? Yeah, I don't know if Finish passed. Uh, can he do that? Oh, he's priding. Oh my god. He actually did not use the other Nino. Interesting. I wonder why he didn't play the other Nino. Because he didn't think he could break. Yeah, but 
Oh, okay. Like winning is not worth it. Like he oh, right, if you don't break, yeah. Future okay. break, right? <coughs> oh my god. Guess sure. the way to get to that back up. Well, he can just ready have whoever he wants. Yep, here we go. Shonjo. Shoji Shono gets up. Border Rider gets up. And then Border Rider gets up. Oh, baby. Sorry, where's Shono get, get up? Because of the, oh, the pro, uh, holding. Holding rate. I would attack, uh, I would attack the meditations with uh, fire or earth. Earth sounds pretty good. You go military earth. Yeah. Uh, you can cavalry in for the plus attack. Yeah. You attack with a Shono, just a Shono. No, uh, or a Shono and a yeah, Porter Rider or something. Second, you need a second character. Yeah. I like this. You could even just attack. With, yeah. You could even just attack with Shono and the uh, Shigenja character, because Anisha's no fate now. So now doesn't have to worry about um. I guess the waves. Oh, you just, oh yeah, right. But I think I think Anish actually or Ronnie actually wants to break, so he probably wants to send more people in. But yeah, he definitely wants to break. Yeah. But the longer uh, Ronnie waits, might not be good. I'm guessing you went with three characters. Three. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I forgot. She always has covert. God damn. I always forget. Oh, that's even better. What is going um military? Well, all right. That's it. Just knock the fade off of the other guy. Oh, doesn't even use the Okay. But I don't think it matters. It won't it definitely won't matter. Okay. So losing an honor for unopposed. Ooh, clarity. Goodbye. Yeah, kill the Nergui to do another military. Yeah. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> you take that. Ooh, I like this a lot. I like this a lot. You just go... You go... Um, you go political first to flip the rally, yeah. and then you go military to do the cavalry reserves. Now that you have the earth ring. Well, you may have to defend here. What, he's going in at political? I guess so, yeah. You have to defend, right? But he doesn't have that much. Oh, he might not have enough political to get in, though. We'll see. But they're about to go to time, so. Yeah. Beep, 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 beep. So Zanish is three points ahead here, so it's not an automatic win. We'll see if there's a concession. So Victor's just walking them through here. So three provinces broken each way, and each has the honor edge, so that's two points for in favor. And also has the imperial favor, one. so that's one point as well. So, is Ronnie conceding? Okay, I was like, why is Ronnie showing cards? Huh, he actually conceded? No, he didn't. Oh. They're playing on. Okay. Because I don't think he can actually win this. Uh, yeah, you just go... So you have no more fate. So there's... Like... He can't play any of this stuff. He can, the only thing he plays is a supernatural storm. Go up to seven if he changes it to military. He sends a... Yeah, you send the... So the thing is, Ronnie can't do two conflicts here. Why can't he? Because he needs to defend against... No, like if he does a captive body, he has to turn it into political. Or turn it back to military. Oh, did he, did, is he not doing a conflict, or...? Oh, uh, weird. He chose to defend. Odd. He has okay. to. One supernatural storm and he's done, right? Yeah, but like, you can just... Maybe he doesn't have enough... Uh... Oh. 
Okay. Oh. Oh, court game's bad. Yeah, that, I think that's it. Well, it's only f five to four. Five to three? She, she has, he oh, has two on. glory. No, sorry. I, I forgot that she was on it. So five to four. Let me pass. I don't think, yeah, I don't think we can get any higher. And there's nothing else after that. Yeah. Uh, good clarity. No, no fate. No fate. That's the that's the big that's the big key right here, because he has no fate. So, can go up to seven, but that's not enough to break. So. Interesting. So it's four. Yeah, it's not enough to break. So Pride loses it. That's okay. Steals an honor. Yeah, we'll go to six. Pass. Oh, it was military. No, oh, that's why. Okay. Hmm? It was military, not political. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter, but still. It was political. Oh. Because it, it looks like it's on its military side. Eh, whatever. Okay, military fire. La da da. Let's switch it. And then he's gonna switch it back. Oh, right. Yeah, Captain Audience, right? Sorry. Yep. Goes There's to one honor. Company. Goes up to two. Doesn't have a censure. Thank God. Then. <laughs> <laughs> Cow preserves. Can he bring? Does he have uh, enough useful cavalry? What's that? He's got a Shinjo. No, no, you can't bring those dudes. Oh my God, he's bringing the wrong dudes. Wait, wait, I'll wait. I'll wait until he gets them out. Okay. Okay. Okay, so that's three. Three out of six. Six out of six. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! All what right. a turnaround. Wow. wow. All right. Okay. And that ends. That was uh, not how one. I expected that to end. But uh, No, good, that, like I said. Good game to both players. Yeah. If Ronnie survived that attack with the Feast Fan and yeah. stuff, I mean, that, that was the. I don't know. Maybe if. I, there, I think there was probably a different line for Anish in that yeah. last round. I think Anish could have killed the. Um, Talisman instead of the. For pre, but. Yeah. I don't know.